Hello, my name is James Briscoe. I'm a researcher at the Francis Crick Institute. and I'm also editor in chief of the journal Development. At Development, we publish cutting edge research from across the spectrum of animal and plant development. We're the leading community journal in the field and we're interested in anything and everything to do with developmental biology, stem cells and regeneration. Now, as well as primary research, we also publish a diverse array of review and hypothesis articles. And our goal at development is to foster and support both the members and the research of the developmental biology community. We're interested in research papers that provide a novel perspective and advance our understanding of development. So as well as experimental studies, we are also interested in computational and mathematical studies that provide significant new insight into developmental biology topics. We also have a techniques and resources section, and in that we publish methods, data sets and other types of resources that will be of interest to our community. At Development, we believe in offering our authors a choice of publishing routes, including open access. Open access allows a, a broader set of readers worldwide to access the research as soon as it, it's published. Our Read and Publish initiative enables corresponding authors at participating institutions to publish an unlimited number of open access articles without having to pay a fee. Read and Publish is already having a big impact on development. As there are no open access fees to pay, more and more of our authors are able to publish open access, and the proportion of open access content in our journal has been increasing fast. We're delighted to be getting fantastic feedback from authors who can now publish their work without paying a fee. Early career researchers in particular have welcomed the opportunity to make their research more widely accessible, and this is beneficial to their careers. Read and Publish is making a big difference for both our authors and our readers. As more institutions sign up to our Read and Publish agreements, more and more of our authors are able to publish their research open access with us. Mm -hmm.